Why? Because God is infinite. And it's got infinity time to be here. It's been here ever since the ever since. So it's bored. It wants to have some fun. So what does it do? It creates this world. This is not the only world God has created or it's existing right now. Let's not get really excited about it and become very possessive of this world. It's the infinite. It's imagining this world. It can imagine thousands of worlds and experiences simultaneously. And is there no guilt also? No what? Guilt. Guilt. No, because did you, when you were seven, eight years old, did you play nurse and doctor? Did you play any kind of? Yeah, I think so, yeah. Huh? Yes, yes. Did you have fun? Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, and when somebody died in your imagination, in your game, did you feel guilty? Mm. We didn't play dying, we just experienced body or, or something play, like that. Play a game in your mind, play a game right now. Mm. And in this game, someone dies and some people live. And see if you feel guilty. Do it right it's now. Yes, okay. If it's a game, no, I don't feel guilty. It is a game. This but, whole thing is a game. Yeah. But people it, won't consider it, it as a game if uh, uh, six million of people were killed. Yeah, of course, because they're not supposed to. Because they're supposed to remain into the game and come back and do another round of this game. Mm. This is God's will. If God wanted you and wanted the entire world to awaken, then there is no more game. It's finished. The game only exists as long as you believe it. As long as you believe you're in the game, so it's real. If you realize it, that, that it's not real, then it's over. It won't happen. However, within the game of God that is enjoying duality, God creates the duality, the opposites. And one cannot exist without the other one. Okay, let's get this really straight for all of you. You can't have the good stuff in this life without the misery. You cannot have it. All the good feelings and good stuff you want to experience, the opposite of it must be experienced in this world, whether you experience it or someone else experience it. They can't exist. They come together. So the idea of having a perfect world, it's great. But it just won't happen. It can happen for a few moments, but that's it. Hi, Eva. I am trying, okay, good. Well, I can follow your thinking, and I am, my mind has, has no objections. Uh, still, I wonder if God or life is bored by only living in love and peace, why should we go against God's will? Okay, I didn't quite understand. I'm sorry, say that again. Yeah, I mean, uh, uh, God has been bored, bored. It's, it's not funny 
all if you live in love and peace. You, you don't get it. I, I'm not hearing you. It's not that uh, I don't okay. understand. Am I on your screen? Okay, I can write it instead. I write it instead. You can't hear. You can't hear. I can hear you right now. Just stay where you're at. Okay. God has decided to, to the game like you described. Okay. To, to experience both good and bad. And right. Uh, why shall we go against his will to experience all the bad things and the good things? Yeah, you because your, your method. Uh, right. Because you don't have a choice. You, you have no say here in this world. Uh, as I understand, it, that's, that's uh, the only thing about the free will is that you think we have a free will if we make your tools and if we go within ourselves. And right. experience love and and and, and right. no, so you, that, even, that's a choice. Even that is not a choice. Uh, explain that something more about it. Yeah, it's God's will that you're here on this platform that you're hearing what I have to say, okay. and it's God's will that you will go inwards and connect with the stillness. You have nothing to say in this transaction. Okay, great. I'm satisfied with your answer. Thank you. Thank you very much. Okay. You and I have zero to say. Okay. Okay, I'm happy with that. <laughs> yeah, so when I was sitting at the feet of Master Punjaji, and there was 150 of us, I was consider myself a boy and ignorant. And I had no idea who I have come across. I had no idea I was sitting at the presence of a Yani. I had no idea I was sitting at the presence of the Buddha. I had no idea I was sitting at the presence of the Jesus Christ or Christ con consciousness. 